I'm uh, Mark Wilkie, I'm 32, I work for Network Rail and I'm a structures examiner. What we do is um, all the infrastructure that Network Rail own across the country, um, viaducts, bridges, uh, retaining walls and stuff, our job is to, to check them yearly for safety compliance just to make sure that, that the infrastructure itself is safe for the general public. The further south I work is Preston but I work all the way up to um, Gretna, just just below Gretna over the border and then um, I work right out from Whitehaven and Barrow on the coastal route right across to the Settle Carlisle line. I came from a military background, I came from the Navy and, and when I was when I was leaving I, I just decided that I wanted to do something something really engineering based. The civil engineering world itself was was growing and also the rail industry at the time was also um, growing so it just made sense for me to kind of go into the rail industry and the civil engineering side of things and I enjoyed it. As I carried out my HNC uh, I looked at, at becoming um, EngTech and uh, becoming a member of the ICE. I tend to get more recognition off, off the engineers above me having my EngTech. I think that helps with, with what I say to them with the structures and the defects and, and how I explain things to them. And when you've got companies like Network Rail and, and other big companies that support you and they, they pay for your fees and things, then for me it was a win-win situation. When we actually got the qualification, uh, yeah, I was very pleased for having all that hard work to pay off and actually for me to be recognised was, yeah, it was, it was very good. I would say anyone that's wanting to go for Eng Tech, it's definitely worth doing. It's enjoyable, it was a good process, and I think you get a lot out of it at the end. It's very beneficial for my job day to day, and it can only be good for the future.